What's that? Oh, you mean you don't know? Beautiful train you got here. Miss McBean was just telling me all about her. Name's Ned. How do you do? I won't take up more of your time. Uh, if you want to learn a thing or two about the finest transit systems in the world, you can find me at this address. Let us return to locating the Peace of Eden. We need to reclaim London from Staric. Who are my targets? It's not time for that yet. I didn't come to London to hunt curios. First understand the dance, only then become the dancer. Oh, so you're taking over where father left off. Someone has to. Evie, finding the precursor artifact will give us an insight into what the Templars intend. Jacob, I have information about Starek's associates that should be of use to you. Here. This soothing syrup has become the only medicine available in Lambeth. It bears the Templar Grandmaster's name. About time for a visit to the doctor. I don't see that cure arriving any time soon. And what exactly will you be doing, might I ask? You know very well. Tracking down the Peace of Eden. Enjoy your studies. I'll be out killing Templars.
Ah, another exciting night home for Evie Fry. Just on my way out, actually. I found the piece of Eden. What's this one going to do, hmm? Heal the sick, deflect bullets, control the populace. They're dangerous objects, Jacob, especially in Templar hands. Oh, you sound exactly like father. If only. Lucy Thorne is expecting a shipment tonight. She's Starek's expert in the occult. I'm nearly certain she is receiving the piece of Eden Sir David Brewster mentioned. Sounds like fun. Mind if I join you? Promise you will stick to the mission. I swear. The contents of that box are worth more than your life and those of your entire family. Do you understand? Yes, Miss Thorne. Uh, careful there! And double the guard on that cart! Now, Miss Thorne, there's the matter of some uh, papers for Mr. Starrick. If you'll just come this way. Very well, but make it quick. Whatever it is she's after, it's in that chest. There are gunmen on the rooftops. Can you dispose of them before I reach the cart? I was hoping for a challenge. I could use your help. Just let me, I can help. You're a dead...
dagger up. If the police don't take the body, the rats will. Once. It serves you right. Oh. Actually, there he is. I think it's best we leave. What did you do? It's hardly the time for questions. Whoa! Come on! I'd better get home before they block the streets. Would you drive a little more carefully? You're endangering the documents. Oh, good documents. Perhaps you'd rather I just stop right here. the train for you. Like a paint, new rugs from Camden Loch, and my wee sister, the seamstress, did a discount on the curtains. Solid oak 
okay. Good for putting a bit of stick about. Fetching outfit, I must say. Evie, have you been out tidying up London? What an enjoyable day. What with Miss Thorne and the papers and all. You may have not found a piece of Eden, but this material is invaluable. Look. It says the London assassins had found a shroud. The shroud of Eden is supposed to heal even the gravest injury. If the assassins had found something like this, surely Father would have known. There must be something we're missing. Something only we can see. These look like directions. Are you coming? Fieldwork is not really my speciality. We found a clue to a precursor object. Don't you want to follow it? Put that way, one can hardly refuse. There you go. Come on! Do you know what? I think this map may be taking us to the Kenway Mansion. Kenway? The pirate? Master assassin and pirate, yes. How much do you know about the Shroud of Eden? It's said to heal the sick. The popular myth is that it brings people back from the dead, but the assassin records say that's not true. I've never heard of one being in London. Do you really think Edward Kenway could have found one? He travelled extensively, so it's possible. But if he did, he kept it a closely guarded secret. But if it's true, what a find it would be. Indeed. I needed to find out myself. Shroud of Eden. It's said to heal the sick. Popular myth is that it brings people back from the dead, but the assassin records say that's not true. I've never heard of one being in London. Do you really think Edward Kenway could have found one? He travelled extensively, so it's possible. But if he did, he kept it a closely guarded secret. But if it's true, what a find it would be. Indeed. I'm eager to find out myself. I 
I think this is it. I think you're right. Look. I'll be in the study. I don't want to be interrupted unless you have news of the lost notebook. That makes getting in a challenge. You still intend to enter? If this is a Templar stronghold, it won't get any easier. Don't worry. We'll stay well away from Miss Lucy. Shall we? Can you check over there? Of course. That looks interesting.
Miss Thorne is quite the collector. I feel like I'm being watched. What are we looking for? I'm not quite sure. What are the Templars not seeing? Something only we can. Subtle, is it? Clearly, Kenway had a strong sense of spectacle. of the London Assassins. Vault holes, vaults, a hidden key. This is it. You say you heard music. There was no opening there before. It's closing! Yes, I can see that. Help me block it. We need to find another way out. entire vault filled with assassin history left behind once again we'll just have to reclaim this one later or find a better cache we oui. i thought you preferred to stay out of field work i i was thinking more of you and your brother i, I shall provide uh, planning assistance from the train
losing Henry with your piano playing, have you? Don't strike a false note. Try. I brought some books. I hope I'm not intruding by being here. Quite the contrary. It's nice to have the company. A herbarium? Are you collecting flowers for someone? Only myself. I'm told it's something of a British pastime. Did you know, they all have symbolic meanings. I had heard something of the sort. Of course you have. Unfortunately, I have no time to fill the book. I could collect some samples. If you would accept my help. I would appreciate that. Thank you, Miss Fry. <laughs> 